Welcome back to another one. Um, we have the Buzz TV X5, 128 gigs, 4 gigs of RAM. Whew, this thing is a beast. What is new with this thing? So if you watch my previous video, I do dive into the specs a little bit. I do get into uh, some of the features with the remote. Um, I got to say, this is the brand new remote. Some people absolutely love it. Some people don't care for it too much. Some people say it's too many buttons. Um, I'm okay with this remote. It's not the best. It's not the worst. Um, but it's okay. It, it works how it should work. Now, um, here is the box itself. I got to say the build on this thing is it's a freaking beast. This thing is just awesome. It is just awesome. You can feel the fans pushing all of that warm air out. It keeps it very nice and cool. Very, very good. Now, what's new with this thing? Um, 128 gigs. This thing is one of their newest boxes. And this thing is great. Now, we went through some of the specs in my previous videos. And I always like to go through YouTube so I can show you guys exactly what it is, if it works or if it doesn't work, when it comes to 4K quality. So let's check this one out. So the first thing I'm going to come here to is I'm going to go to search and we are going to go to beyond the stream. So if you guys are not familiar with beyond the streams podcast, next level and I have a podcast that we talk about anything tech related streaming. Um, we talk about crypto. We talk about gaming. We talk about what's in the news. There's a lot of stuff that we do talk about here. So make sure you guys do come check us out on beyond the streams podcast. So Pretty good information right here. So we're going to come here and check it out beyond the streams. There it is right there. Um, there is our video. So we hang out with everybody here and there's a lot of stuff here that we talk about. So I'm going to open up virtual dog fence spot on. Um, this thing is insane. So first thing I like to do is I like to come here to the settings and I want to see what the quality is. So automatically it's pulling 720. So I'm going to switch it over to 4K quality right there. Now, give it a few seconds. It does take a minute, um, but as you can see, it looks very, very clean. Now, first thing I like to do is once I have that accomplished, I like to skip about 20, 25, 30 minutes in. See the little spinning wheel? Let's see how long it takes. And boom, it looks amazing. Very, very clean. This was a very, very... A good conversation on spot on, um, but make sure you guys do check out the podcast. Again, we cover everything. We've talked to Tanya from Fire TV Sticks. We talked to a uh, new tech, and here even the Buzz TV guys. We had a good interview with them about a, a little bit over a year ago, before the forty nine hundred was coming out. We talked about some of their stuff right there. So pretty good stuff. Very very fast how everything works. You got VLC. You got some of your settings here. If you go to your settings and you go to your device preference, um, some people always ask how do you get to certain aspects. So if you come here to about, um, you could see all the different stuff here. If you come down to Android TV OS build and you go one two three four five six seven seven clicks on it um you can lock developer options now if you just back up one scroll down just a little bit there it is developer options um you could do a lot of stuff in here so developer options stay awake enable bluetooth hci there's a lot of things here that you can do uh usb debugging if you want to turn that off or on um a lot of things here just make sure when you do come here you know what you're doing don't just start turning things off or on unless you absolutely know what you're doing you can break the box if you don't know what you're doing um, if you need to reset it you could do that there if you if you need to do the storage display sound like just so many things here that you can do advanced sound stuff here if you want to do pass through if you got some good surround sound speakers um Whatever you want to do, this is where you're going to be doing it. Now, when it comes to Prime Video and Disney Plus, I believe it is using 4K quality. Um, if you do get Netflix, uh, Netflix has its own thing. Even though you can have the official Google Chrome or, or the Google Play Store, you still need something above and beyond from Netflix to have it. So, yeah, I wanted to give you... Really quick video, how to get into developer options, how to check some of their the 4K stuff. It's a pretty good device. It's pretty good and powerful. 
check the description below. I try to give you guys links for discount codes for all the latest and greatest. If you're interested in the stuff that I got, shoot me an email, rojasentertainment at gmail.com. Yeah, hope you guys enjoyed this video. Leave me a comment below. Let me know what you guys think with Buzz TV. They come up with a lot of stuff there. They've been slowing down with pushing too much product in one year, um, but they're always giving us some really good stuff, some of the latest and greatest stuff there. So hope you guys appreciated this video. Hope you guys take care, take care of each other, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Take care, guys.